You know, you watch these, these old Woody Allen movies and shit, and you're sitting there like, God damn, this guy was fucking brilliant! And then you watch something he's done a day, like fucking, uh, Match Point or whatever, and, or Scoop. That's a good example, Scoop. I mean, Scarlett Johansson's fucking sexy ass couldn't save that movie. I'm watching that, I'm like, God damn, Scarlett Johansson's in this thing, and it's still not even fucking... I mean, I couldn't even jerk off to it. I mean, Scarlett Johansson's fucking hot. That's like the only celebrity. Like, I hate celebrity chicks. A lot of guys are like, ooh, look, celebrities, you know? I mean, I get that question a lot. What celebrity chick would you fuck? I don't like any of those celebrity chicks. They're all... They're way too skinny. They're, they fucking look bones. I would just imagine, like, my dick would go in there and be, like, hitting ribs and hips and shit. You know, I'd come out and there'd be, like, a wishbone stuck to my dick, because they look all skeletal, you know? I mean, I like Skeletor, but I don't want to fuck him. You understand what I'm saying? There's not enough information here to answer your fucking question, you asshole. What, you, what kind of fucking, what kind of smart ass are you? You just feel like you can come on here and ask me all kinds of fucking, you know, half-baked questions? Like, I, like I'm supposed to be able to answer that? I don't know how many fucking licks it takes to get the center of Tootsie Pop. What, you think I just got fat? I automatically know how many fucking licks it takes? Nineteen hundred and eight. Would you ever decide to grow a beard, shave it off, but remain intact elsewhere, then tie each end of the beard with a string and use it as a fake? Would you put it on your dog? Now I has headphones. They are coal scandy. Coal scandy rule. I like them because they has skulls. It's another Honda Fit. Skulls is good. What? Fuck them and their Honda fitness. Shut up. I, no one wants to hear you fucking in this video, you fucking moron! Get down! Die! I hate you. I hate you. I hate you more. I hate you less. Therefore more. Bitch. Touché. Dear TJ, I am a fur fag. In case you don't know what that is, I masturbate to cartoon pics of animals having sex. I have a dog and I have sucked his dick before, but <laughs> only once. <laughs> I do, I'm sorry. Shut up. I'm oh, sorry. Shut up. I do, however, put gravy on my wing often and have him lick it off. Do you think this is morally wrong, laws aside, and do you think I should continue if it makes me and Max happy? Also, does this make me gay? I love the part at the end. They're like, if you're letting your dog, like, suck you off and, like, doing sexual shit with it, then the gay thing is, is really becoming. I was, like, three issue. miles back, man. <laughs> it's like, it's not important anymore. That's like, you know... That's like Attila the Hun asking if his fashion sense is bad. <laughs> this, is, this is a cute little dog, no doubt. There's no doubt about it. Do you find this dog sexually attractive? If you do, you have some fucking serious problems. It's like that old joke Dad always used to tell, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah. About the preacher, he's like, you know, Come up and confess your skin. Let the, let the world know. It doesn't matter what it is. Ain't no one gonna judge you here. One guy got up and was like, I fucked a chicken. And the preacher's like, I would have kept that one to myself. You know, that that's basically the same same deal. Oh well. Video's gone on way too long now. And uh does this look good? I don't know if that looks good or not. I shaved off most of this. I left a little stubble. I always like the stubbliness. I don't like a clean face. I like kind of a stubbly face. But I shaved off the vast ass majority of my beard. I don't know if that looks good or not. I look really fucking pale. I gotta stand way back so the light doesn't affect it. What do you guys think? Not that your opinions really matter. It's not like I can grow the hair back. I look even worse if I shaved it off. My hair, I got this like the clock can't thing going on here. I don't like it. I don't like it none. All right. <laughs> I don't want to turn off the camera because it's my only friend left in the whole wide world. What's wrong with you people? You're all monsters. You're all demons trying to possess me, aren't you? Ha ha! Woohoo! Alright. That's enough fucking roughhousing. You people need to fucking mature. You need to grow up. Quit watching these kind of videos. Quit favoriting them and five star rating them. It's wrong. It's wrong what you're doing and you know it. You fucking know that shit. You guys are being real immature right now. Just turn off the fucking camera, bitch. Turn off the fucking camera. Just turn it off. I can't, God, I can't. The chains, they hold me back. Why won't it happen for me? You all wrong, everyone. Even you. I love you so much, though, man. God damn it, I love you. God. Why don't you love me back? Love me.
Love me. I am the serpent of death. I believe in nothingness. There is no purpose. There is no reason. There is no rhyme. This is the season that's out of time. Everybody is going to die tonight. <laughs> because I am the new god. And I am a cruel and avengeful god. And I have many penises. And they all shoot cum of different colors in a thousand directions at all times. <sighs> By the, time, by the time I wake up tomorrow morning, it's pretty much a foregone conclusion that I will have past 20,000 subscribers. So, as you sit here and you listen to my inane fucking ramblings, whatever, as I do that, know this, 20,000 people are listening to me. So if you're listening to me and just fuming with hatred for how inane and stupid and pointless all of this is, just know that 20,000 people give a shit for no reason. Just know that more people listen to me than will probably ever listen to you in your whole life. Isn't that fucking hilarious? That amuses the shit out of me. I just wish that I was the most popular person on YouTube. I wish that I was number one. Not because I want the fame, because what the fuck, I mean, I think Smosh is number one, and who the fuck cares about Smosh? They suck a dick. Um, I said it. I don't care. It's not like it's fucking a secret. Uh, they suck. And then you got, like, fucking idiots like Dax Flame and Athene Wins or whatever. It's all fucking garbage. But I wish that I was number one. I wish I was on the top of that heap. Because I know I suck, too. Probably the 99.9% .9 of people, what I do sucks. But I want to be on top for the simple reason that I want to just lord it over all these fucking trolls who wish, who wish in their little black hearts that they just had a fucking fraction of the, the influence that I have. And it's not even a big influence, it's a sad thing. There's no, no one really gives a fuck what I say. That's the beautiful fucking thing. But compared to how few people actually give a shit about what they say, I'm a fucking god. Because when I say people actually give a shit, people respond to this shit, people come on my videos and they favorite them and they comment on them and they send me emails trying to sway my opinion one way or the other because they see me as at least somewhat influential. Even if my influence is, is tiny in comparison to so many people like, I don't know, fucking Noam Chomsky or whatever, even if it's insignificant compared to those people and how they've influenced our society, I have an influence. And that influence drives these fucking troll motherfuckers crazy. Because they gotta wonder, how did this loud mouth, fat, man titted motherfucker get a fucking voice in this world while I'm struggling to even get one person to give a shit about anything that comes out of my mouth? I love that. It makes me so fucking happy. It's the only thing that really keeps me doing this at the end of the day. I mean, sure, I have some fun sometimes, but I put up with a lot of shit. And, you know, it's hard to do this. A lot of times I don't have time to do it. I shouldn't be wasting my time on it. But just knowing that I have even just a little bit of influence over what happens compared to these fuckers who wish and wish and wish with all their little hearts that someone gave a shit, and they never will. They'll die, and no one will give a fuck about what they say. They'll die not respected by their wives, not respected by their children, not respected by their fucking peers, but I, a 23-year-old fat motherfucking loser, here on YouTube, has managed to eke out a little niche of influence. Niche is the correct pronunciation, by the way. It's not niche. Um, oh, well. That's all I got to say, I guess. Uh, amazing Atheist. Peace the fuck out. Uh, I did that. I did, it was way turned off. What the fuck was that? Peace the I just like, ooh, my hand. Mouth going faster than hand. Amazing Atheist. Peace. This is the peace symbol. Fuck. This is the fuck symbol. Out. And that's just the wave. It says, bye-bye. Fat guy shouldn't wave, anyway. You got these jaily underarms. I actually got some pretty fucking boss biceps. Mmm. But you got this jiggly arm fat underneath that kind of fucking makes them look unimpressive. But that's solid muscle up there.